Open prayer for Lent. Jesus, I invite you. I welcome you. I welcome your presence, your love, your joy, your peace, and your salvation. Amen. Lenten message is forgiveness requires forgiveness. Scripture, Matthew 6, verses 12 through 15. 12, and forgive us our debt as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For as you forgive others then their sins, you, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive their sins, your Father will not forgive your sins. By now you may be asking if it is possible to forgive others if they sin against you. The answer is yes, for the Bible tells us so. God gave us the opportunity to forgive. I can bear witness. As I meditated on forgiveness, I went down memory lane. I was a teenager walking in my neighborhood in East Baltimore with my mother. Approaching us was a neighbor who did a terrible thing against our family. As we got closer, the neighbor turned her head, trying to avoid speaking to us. But my, God, but my Bible reading mother said, good morning. The neighbor reluctantly said, good morning in a low voice. I could not understand how my mother could speak to this neighbor who had done this terrible thing against our family. My mother explained, Junior, I hated what she did, but I do not hate her. So in essence, my mother was forgiving her. At that time, I did not understand, but as I grew older, I, I started to understand about forgiveness. So thank you, Holy Spirit, for showing me it is possible to forgive and demonstrate that it is possible to give, forgive others and remembering that forgiveness requires forgiveness. Mark eleven twenty five, Jesus also reminds us about forgiving. If you hold anything against anyone, forgive them so that your Father in heaven may forgive you also, your sins also. Let us be committed to forgive others of their sins that we can be forgiven our sins. Are you committed to forgiveness? During this Lenten season, let us be committed to be better Christians today than we were yesterday. We invite you to worship with us in person or virtually at the Zion Baptist Church 